The Mermaid Saga, a dark tale of immortality, violence, and loss. Without a doubt, this is one of Rumiko Takahashi's most somber serials. The story follows Yuta, a 500-year-old fisherman who has wandered through life anonymously, encountering those who would seek the same immortality he accidentally acquired. It is not until he meets Mana, a young woman made immortal in the mid-1980s, that he finally gains a companion and his life of isolation eases. The Mermaid Saga is a sporadic series. Takahashi published the serial with some regularity in the 1980s and the early 1990s, but since then she has not revisited it. However, before any OVAs or TV series took place, the first adaptation was one of the most unique and ephemeral of all media, a radio broadcast, a musical drama for NHK, Japan's public broadcasting company. Entitled Musical Fantasy, Mermaid Forest, the musical drama was an adaptation of two early Mermaid Saga storylines, A Mermaid Never Smiles and The Village of Fighting Fish. Airing on November 3rd, 1989, the radio play predates the first anime adaptation by almost two years. Running 75 minutes, the radio drama has been rerun once in 1990 and again in 2019 as a 50-minute digest version of the original, focusing on the songs rather than the narrative. The drama was directed by Yoshihisa Hoshina, a veteran of many NHK radio dramas. The screenplay and lyrics were handled by Shoichiro Okubo. Okubo did screenplays for a number of other television dramas, such as Manga Michi, an autobiographical drama about Fujiko Fujio. He also worked on the second Lupin the Third anime series, Paman and Ninja Hattori-kun. Interestingly, he would go on to write the screenplay for the 1991 Mermaid Forest OVA, which adapted a different story from that which was covered in the radio drama. The music is handled by Japanese keyboardist Keiichi Oku. Oku wrote the musical scores for television dramas, as well as providing the soundtrack for a few anime releases, including Crusher Joe, Marmalade Boy, and Peacemaker Kurogane. I asked Oku-san on Twitter if there was a listing of song titles anywhere for the Mermaid Forest radio play. Unfortunately, he answered that there was not, since it was never released on CD. Rounding out the staff, effects were handled by Ichiro Takahashi, and Hidetsugu Nakamura was the engineer. As for the cast, Yuda was played by Goro Noguchi, a Japanese singer who debuted in 1971 and has continued to have a lasting career ever since. Noguchi performed at the Kohaku Udagasen New Year's Eve Song Contest in 1972 and has made a number of dramas throughout his lengthy career. Kaho Shimada did double duty in the drama, playing Mana and also Rin. Shimada was at the height of her popularity at the time. She was in the midst of performing the most memorable role of her career, Eponine in Les Miserables in Japan. In fact, she played Eponin to Goro Noguchi's Marius. She has had major roles in other musical theater, including Maria in West Side Story and Annie Oakley in Annie Get Your Gun. Hisako Okada rounded out the cast as the role credited as Older Woman. She is a veteran of many television dramas and some anime roles, having done vocal work in Ashita no Jo and 3000 Leagues in Search of Mother. Musical fantasy Mermaid Forest is a unique and rare adaptation, the first such example of adapting the Mermaid Saga into another format beyond its original manga. If you would like to listen to the program, you can click the link at the end of the video to hear the original 1989 production for yourself.